Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. We are in my GM. What I'm going to do is I'm going to simulate 10 games and then we're going to see where we stand. I don't want to start playing any games yet because it's going to be unfair. I can go 82 and 0. But uh, I want to let you guys know that I have been upgrading Sam Hinkie very well. Right now, he is the coach and the GM. He basically can make all the decisions coaching wise and not get affected at all from Brett Brown. Brett Brown would totally be happy with any moves that Sam Hinkie currently makes, as well as I'm trying to grow him with trading and uh, signings so I can basically trade away any players and get OK players or bad players and, you know, other teams would be happy with the way that I do business. But uh, I don't have any special abilities right now. As of right now, I'm just still growing, but it's time to get into Sam Hankey mode. Are you guys ready for Sam Hankey? As a new GM starting out, what are you hoping to accomplish here in Philadelphia? <laughs> I may be new to the profession, but I know my way around negotiation. I expect great things for this organization. I can't wait. This man is lying through his teeth, but his press conference does go well the first time around. But let's simulate these next 10 games to see what happens. Got some bad news, Sam. Jason Richardson has suffered an injury, a broken hand four to six weeks, and is unable to play. What do you want to do? Well, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to handle this. Sam Hinky is in Sam Hinky mode. We need to make that a hashtag, Sam Hinky mode. But basically, I can change up anything I want like I told you guys before. Uh, I'm going to actually rebuild the roster automatically. I'm not going to go in and uh, take away people minutes and give other guys the starting chance. Because I was looking at Tony Roten and he's only a 63 overall. But in order for him to get better, he needs minutes. So I'll just rebuild it regular. He's going to end up getting more minutes anyway since Jason Richardson is out. Um, also, isn't it cheese that Evan Turner isn't in a roster lineup when you start it out? It, it kind of throws me off, man. Evan Turner already with the Pacers at the start of the season. So you know he's getting burned behind Stevenson and uh, Paul George. But it's cool. But uh, I'm rebuilding this. Uh, Noel. Definitely well above 26 minutes, so the GM, I mean, not the GM, the owner won't have to worry about that. You know, that's that's cake right there. But uh, let's see what Sam Hinkie has to say about changing up these rosters. Thanks for bringing this to my attention. I have adjusted the rotations. Okay, I will monitor Jason Richardson's progress and let you know if anything changes. All right, check this out. My iPhone is ringing. Who is this? DC, I have a trade offer for you that I think you might be interested in. All right, so let's see what this trade is all about. Gerald Henderson and Chris Douglas Roberts for Hollis Thompson and Thaddeus Young. Now, Hollis Thompson is a three point shooter on our team that has a pretty good a rating, you know, for 2K. And Thaddeus Young is our star player at a 79 overall. But they're willing to give me a shooting guard that's willing to start right now at 74 overall and a small forward that is actually better than Hollis Thompson. I have to take this deal. I have plenty of power forwards. That is young. See ya. Looks fantastic, Paul. It's a deal. Excellent. I'm glad we were able to work something out. Hi, Sam. We should adjust the roster after your latest move. Would you rather do it yourself or have the coach take care of it? Well, it looks like I'm going to have to change up something again. Time to rebuild. Let's do this. Sixers Nation. I've taken care of it. Thank you for the update. Thanks for reviewing and integrating the new players. <laughs> hey, Sam. I just wanted to remind you that if you want to make any changes to the player minutes, you can open up the rotations menu where you can adjust anyone from the roster. Well, I already knew that, but thanks a lot. Thanks, Mike. This will be very helpful. Always happy to help. Let's keep going. Would you like to scout specific prospects, or would you like to give me a general direction on who to scout? Well, James, I really trust your judgment on these matters, and I feel confident that you could take care of all of the scouting decisions going forward. Thanks, Sam. It's great working for somebody that trusts my ability. I won't let you down. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have simulated 10 games. We are currently four and six, that's not bad. Three of those four wins are home games, so we are on a good tear for winning 19 home games this season. But I know for sure that around February, I will have to play more games in the season to actually keep the owner in my good running, I guess you could say. Uh, right now, LeBron James is testing free agency on the coming offseason. Will he become a 76er? That is the question. I'm going to try to do as much as I can to build a team around LeBron James. Probably a lot of shooters, some good rebounders, not necessarily great scorers in the paint, but definitely great rebounders with Noel. And uh, hopefully in the next year's draft, I can get him beat. But I'm just going to have to tell you guys like this. I'm going to try to breeze through these My GM episodes as fast as I can. Because, like I said, man, we got about another month until 2K15 comes out. So, I really do want to get this done for you guys. I know that it took a long time for me to actually do this series. Because my career took so long without having a... Uh, you couldn't key game at all. And, you know, I had other engagements that I had to fulfill. Other games that I had to play. I am a gamer at the end of the day, you know. So, I love playing video games. But, this is IKC signing out. I hope you guys subscribe, like, comment. And I'm going to see y'all in the next episode of My GM. This is Sam Hinkie signing out. Bye, guys.